Hello fellow YouTube pipe smokers, I finally figured I would go ahead and get a video going. Um, this is take two for me, my uh, mic was not on when I was recording previously, but uh, that's alright. I uh, just wanted to uh, go ahead and uh, introduce myself, say hi, um, you know I've been watching everybody's videos uh, online, Pipe Friend, uh, Dub in the Dam, uh, Mock Mock Mark, um, you know several others, whoever else I can find that's had some videos up there. You all have great pointers, I've been uh, really into this, I think I've been smoking since uh, November of last year, and uh, I've had uh, the privilege to try several tobaccos, uh, still trying to figure out something that I uh, really, really like, but uh, we're going through everything. I've, right now I've been smoking uh, Caravan by GLPs, I believe, and I just picked up some uh, Westminster that I haven't had a chance to try yet, and unfortunately I uh, can't really smoke inside here, so uh, hoping to get a camera sometime soon to go outside and uh, have a smoke while I'm uh, doing one of my videos. Um, I've also tried uh, Peterson's Irish Flake. Uh, Dub in the Dam had uh, raved about this one, but it's just too strong for me. I, um, it, I, I like the taste. It's a great smoke, but it's just too much. I think I've used one flake out of it, and it was just too much for me. Um, if anybody has a, uh, a trade for something uh, not quite so strong that you might think would be a good uh, tobacco for me to try, we could uh, maybe arrange something. I've also tried... Uh, Connoisseur's Choice by Peterson's. It's an aromatic, and uh, this isn't a bad uh, aromatic, actually. I, I'm not a big fan of them, but when I'm around other people, I can smoke that, and uh, it doesn't bite too much at all. Um, I've also got just a couple pipes so far. I got these on a, uh, got a good deal on a, on a um, estate pipe uh, auction on eBay. Uh, this one's a uh, Stanwell, a little uh, bent Stanwell pipe. Um, I think this auction, that this came in, it was this and one other pipe. It was about... Uh, 15 or 20 dollars after shipping and uh, wasn't really labeled very well but I uh, got lucky and there was a Stanwell in it and then it came with this one which is I believe by Cigars, Pipes and More. I haven't really heard anything about them at all just a you know probably a basket pipe whatever um, but I use I use this to smoke my aromatics out of and it works uh, works pretty well I don't have any problem smoking it um, doesn't get too hot or anything it, it, it works for its purpose now um, I'm still looking for more pipes, don't have a lot of money to buy them. Uh, the girlfriend would uh, you know, not be too happy if I spent a whole lot. Um, but I just wanted to uh, get on here say hi. Oh, and uh, Pipe Friend had mentioned, um, he put up a video today about his uh, least favorite pipe. Um, I picked up this Church Warden uh, on uh, eBay for, again, probably 10 or $15 max. And uh, got it home and uh, thought it looked good on the auction, but it has this nice dark spot you can probably see there. Um, the bowl is completely almost all the way burned through and uh, first time I tried to smoke it that spot actually started smoking it got really extremely hot and I just had to give up on it almost threw it away I don't know why I even still have it but uh, yeah useless pipe completely not even worth keeping around um, other than that um, I've got a couple other videos on my account if you guys want to go take a look um, I did a beer, beer review a few months back or something like that um, didn't really, uh, haven't really done more since then. I wanted to, but just haven't done it. Um, if you have any beers you want me to try, let me know. Um, you know, the, I love beer. I have tried probably a hundred or more types of beer. I don't even know, um, but I've always been really into beer. I'm from Oregon originally, and we have all kinds of uh, small breweries there, and, and I love going around Oregon trying out all the different beers. Um, so let me know if there's something you think I might be able to get. It's kind of hard to get microbrews here. I'm, I'm actually in New Mexico now. Um, and uh, I've had a really hard time finding some, some good microbrews. Uh, but if you think there's one that I might try that I haven't tried yet, let me know. Um, and uh, I've also got a few video game uh, clips up there, just with some uh, screen captures I've done while playing some video games. Um, I might do some more of those too, let me know. Um, I'm playing most anything at this point. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's pretty much uh, all of the uh, kind of my experience so far with, with uh, pipe smoking. I really enjoy it. Um, and uh, let me know if there's any other, I'm trying to get into English tobacco, so let me know if there's any other uh, ones that I should try. I've, I've looked on, uh, what is it, tobaccoreviews.com. Um, Westminster is just raved about on there. There's 100 and some reviews, and it's a four-star tobacco, so I might go ahead and try that one. I know a lot of people have mentioned uh, Frog Morton. Um, haven't been able to get that one from my local tobacconist. Might have to order it online, not sure, but I want to try that one too. Uh, Give me some uh, feedback, uh, send me a message, let me know if there's something I should try. Thanks for all the advice for everybody out there who are uh, all the experienced pipe smokers. I've uh, taken a lot of it to heart and, and it has uh, really helped it be an uh, enjoyable experience. I, I did start out, um, you know, rookie mistake, smoking aromatic tobaccos and I didn't really like it, wasn't, wasn't that into it. 
Um, but then I started smoking, you know, some other stuff like the Caravan, um, and uh, now I'm going to try the Westminster, and I'm, I'm enjoying that stuff a lot more than the uh, Aramax. But uh, thanks for the videos, guys. Um, I'm hoping to uh, maybe I'll make some more probably you know, once a week, maybe something like that. Um, as I occasionally get, uh, you know, tobaccos here, I'm buying them just an ounce at a time, basically, from my tobacconist because I'm not smoking a whole lot. don't even smoke every day. But, uh, again, just thanks for the reviews. You guys are all great. It's been a uh, um, good time watching all your videos and, and figuring out, you know, what kind of tobaccos I should try. Um, thanks again, and uh, have a, a good rest of your Sunday.